weather coverage now. The extreme heat isn't stopping tourists from getting out and enjoying the outdoor attractions in Branson. Color 10's Crystal Blair is live tonight. She spoke with some people enjoying the very warm outdoors today, as well as a doctor who shared with us some important summer related heat tips we should all keep in mind. Crystal? Well, David and Heather, you know there's some people who are going to have fun outdoors no matter what the weather is doing. However, if they do decide to brave these temperatures, there are a few things they need to know. Prehydrate before you ever go outside. Doctor's orders. Drink lots of water or Gatorade, not just while in the heat, but before heading out. Less headaches, less fatigue. Less Dr. Todd Baker, chief of staff at Cox Branson, says they treat a lot of fatigue and headache related to heat. The treatment or the things that we do and the things we see are usually not quite to the heat stroke level, but the treatment's the same. You want to get indoors, you want to cool off, and obviously hydrate as much as possible. So if you just have to be outside on a hot day like today, there are signals your body will give you to let you know you may be in trouble. You can eventually start getting worsening of those signs that will eventually lead to nausea. Uh, it can lead to kind of muscle pain and fatigue all over and then just not feeling good. And, and usually by that point you know, okay, I got to get some, get some help or get indoors or hydrate. And then there are those who work outdoors. We just really push real hydration. Greg Westcott, so CEO and co-owner of Track Family Fun Park says, his employees are prepared. We talk a lot about the heat in our stand-up meetings before every shift. Um, our management team really keeps an eye on our employees, makes sure that everybody looks, looks healthy, and if somebody needs a break or just even a little shot of air conditioning for a few minutes, we do that sort of thing. I'm from the heat. I mean, Dallas, Texas is hot. But I'll tell you, like getting in the car, it feels like the plastic, the leather is melting. So just in case you missed it, the best prevention for heat-related illness? Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. So I don't think you missed that. Now, Dr. Baker also said if you're actually in the water, enjoying some uh, in-water activity while you're outdoors, there's a lesser risk of you getting some heat-related illness. Reporting live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Color 10 News, Ozarks First. And the pools will be busy. Crystal, thank you. We have new information.